Oh, on a slide. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Hang on. Wait, should I start like Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. I have actually managed a week. So I have just woken up. I'm just getting out of bed now. I um, ended up sleeping in my clothes last night because I was so, so cold. I need to go down and tell the maintenance people about my radiator not working. I should probably do that at some point today. I'm also working today, but that's later on in the evening. That's nothing to worry about just yet. But I'm so, so scared that this Vlogmas is going to go downhill from here because... Let me just put you on my side while I chat to you, actually. Because I am working the next three days. Today is Friday, and I work Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, so I'm scared that obviously whilst I'm at work, I'm not going to, I can't film anything at work, obviously. And I'm scared that I'm not going to get enough content during the day to actually make a good vlog. Um, not that my vlogs are good anyway, but, but Monday I'm going back to Sheffield to kick off Christmas, I guess. We're going to go pick a Christmas tree and I'm so excited. I'm also quite annoyed that London has not snowed. Like, I woke up this morning and checked people's Snapchats and so many people were posting. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? So many people were posting about it snowing and London's got no snow. Oh, you fucking just shut up. You shut yourself up. I did nothing. I was telling you. What? what? I just I was telling a story of it's not snowing in London and I was upset about no, it. I know, everyone at home is being like, oh look how much snow it is. Exactly. <laughs> I just got in bed with my cereal and I'm going to watch the Kardashians, but look how Christmassy it is. <laughs> okay, you got it? <laughs> oh, Christmas. Oh, Christmas. Don't tell her it's Christmas. Oh, Christmas. Christmas. Oh, Christmas. Oh, Christmas. This is what I'm going to do for the next 40 minutes. Alright, so the maintenance guy has just been round sorting out my radiator. Um, I don't know if he's done it actually. He sorted something out in here and then went outside and like did a bunch of things. So, maybe my radiator is going to be working later on tonight. He said it'll take two hours and then maybe it'll work, but they don't know. They've just tried something. But I got ready in that time. I am wearing this for work. Um, just this no face t shirt, my necklaces that I always wear, a red stussy cap. And then I'm wearing these new suede Adidas tracksuit bottoms. I really need to hoover my floor. But yeah, I have work in like five hours and I'm ready for work already. But like, I'm ready for the day and then I can just wear this to work anyway. So yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, I've got nothing to do, literally nothing to do until I go to work. I might cook a pizza. That is a good shout actually. I might go and cook a pizza. Hmm. The sunset is so freaking pretty and you can't even see it that good out of this window, but it's so nice. Me too. I had to put my pizza in like a bowl because my plate's not big enough. It's a first for me, but what can you do? I'm still watching Zoe's vlog by the way. Still eating pizza. Good morning. I just love Paddington. It's so cosy. And the actual film was insane. Okay, so it's a little while later now. Um, I don't know what I've done in that time. I think the last clip I filmed was me eating pizza, I believe. But yeah, it's been a little while later now. I've not done anything since then. I've just been watching Instagram live videos and YouTube videos. But now me and Haz are actually heading out because we're meeting up with Saffron and Anastasia. I thought we were meeting Jazz, but Jazz is not actually in London anymore. She's gone home. I'm so upset that I didn't get to see Jazz while she were here. But we're going to meet up with Anastasia and Saffron for a little bit and then I'm working in like an hour. So we're going to meet up with them and then I'm going to head to work. So let me just check, see if I've got everything and then we're going to leave. Hopefully when I come back in from work, the heating should have sorted itself out so it'll be nice and warm in my room. First time I've been outside today. This is a common thing in my vlogs. Oh, same actually. Ooh. A bit fucking chilly and tits. All right, has gonna get demonetized. Thanks for that. <laughs> Bitch, the shit. Right, we're going to Westfields now to meet Anna and Saffron and then I have work. The Christmas tree that they've put up in our like, accommodation thing is disgusting, let me show you. I mean, it's not been precisely decorated, let's just say that. 
<laughs> it is honestly so so cold. We've just arrived at Westfield. Where are we actually meeting the song? I don't know. I've just texted them about Get me inside. Oh, oh, okay. Just in top shop changing rooms. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, we're gonna top shop. Right, I'm not actually showed you the Christmas lights in Westfield yet. That boy's just in background. <laughs> Uh, I'm not sure there's the Christmas lights in Westfield, but they're so so British. I'll show you in one minute. Like, I can't believe that boy just did that. What the hell? What did he do? He was like, yeah. if I got him on wall. Look! I don't know how I feel about them. They are pretty, but I think they're a bit tacky. They are cute though. So I just talked about EOS lip balms because you know I'm obsessed with mine and it has just goes I might have to buy some because like I need some yeah, my lips are dead Honestly EOS if you want to yeah, sponsor me then like hit me up If you um, want to sponsor me then hit me up Honestly <laughs> What is going on? Hang on Wait should I start like Right we're with Anna and Saffron now Saffron's just actually losing the plot <laughs> No Bye <laughs> <laughs> Me. Okay, so I've just finished work. I am now heading to meet Haz, Anastasia and Saffron. My cheeks are super red because it's so cold outside. I've just ran from the tube station to get the tube. And now I'm getting on another tube to go to the hotel. But work was fun. <laughs> I'm joking. Work. Honestly, tube, I'm trying to bomb. Work were alright, it weren't too bad. I'm super hyper, I've had three bottles of coke. And I really want a coffee. Ugh, I can't even talk. I really want a coffee. Not for the like hyper fact of it, because I think I've had enough to make me hyper and stimulate me for tonight. But stimulate me for tonight, that sounds like I'm about to be aroused and perform some sexual acts. I'm not. Yeah, I'm now gonna go to their hotel. I really don't know where it is though, but apparently I've got to get on another tube, so I'm going the right way. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. Right, what the hell? Right, I don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna stop vlogging because I'm gonna get lost, but I'll see you when I'm in their hotel room. Am I even going the right way? I honestly have no idea. I'm on the right track. Life's looking up. God is paying me favours, people are staring at me from the other side of the tube, you know, it's alright, love my fans, honestly, subscribe to me, if you want to watch my daily vlogs, it's Vlogmas, you know. Whoa, this is chilly. Right, this pigeon literally goes nowhere near any of other people apart from me. Like, he keeps coming back, like, why is he not threatened by me? Does he think I look like a pigeon? Probably do, but fuck off. I'm in the lift of the hotel, I don't really know where I'm going, but hopefully they're out of this door when I get out of the lift, but I'm not too sure. <laughs> That's what the fuck. I literally just said I don't know if you're on this floor and you just stood there like that. Brilliant. Right, we're leaving Anna and Saffron now. I didn't film anything in the room because they're literally in bed. Like they were in bed doing face masks and we and Haz were just chilling. I didn't say bye to them either because Saffron were literally asleep. Anna says you're awake but I don't think it were appropriate to be like, bye guys! Me and Haz are um, going to get the tube home now. I really want a McDonald's so... Please no. Haz, I'm starving Haz. And if you're watching, Haz is refusing me our food and I am starving. I've been at work, you've not been at work, I have. We've got to get up early tomorrow. We're going to oh, marble we'll actually lunch. end tomorrow. No, we're going to marble Yeah, but can we go at like 11 and then meet them at 12? Have an yeah. hour in urban and then meet them at 12. I don't think, think like, um, common. Right, we're going to get on the tube now anyway. Or at least we're going to walk to the McDonald's thing on the tube. Oh, don't do this. Okay. So. This is me, outdoors, at 2am, in London, love life. Going to McDonald's. Do you know what's actually funny? The McDonald's is closer than the tube station, but has still refuses to go. Like, I mean, oh my god, they've got McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> Them, I smell fries. I right, smell that's fun. it. McDonald's is literally on this corner, has tube okay, stations there, fine, and McDonald's fine, there. Fine. Yes, I know I'd get my own way, bitch. <laughs> love life. <laughs> Alright, right, you get on tube then, see you later, because you're not going to go on your own, are you? Actually, loving my life. Oh my god, they said Nando's as well. Nando's is not open, but... Oh. Love my life. Fuck me up, actually. Fuck me up. How do I get in? Yes. Oh. 
<laughs> no, it's right. Joe, you know when I just said I will love in my life, we'll just take that phrase back because McDonald's is actually closed. It literally closed like eight minutes ago. Like, is that a joke? It's like eight minutes oh, past two. Food, but... yeah. Has. I always knew you'd get your own way. I wonder if he makes any good food. I'm hungry. Oh my god, it's like Ratatouille. I actually am hungry. Come back. Yeah, leaving at 11, sadly. Good I night, Haz. <laughs> no, I've got to go in the food and make kitchen and make food now. Yeah, that. Night. Right, I'm checking to see if my room's warm because if the ra <laughs> if the radiator thing has worked like the maintenance guy said, I don't think it's true. I think he's lying. Oh wait, you've got a door there though, so you could be telling the truth actually. Has. Dad, it says please use the portable heater for now. We've been working to fix the problem. Thanks. Oh, that's oh, so that is sweet. cute. You're yeah. Gonna that right next to your bed, Trust me, I am having that in my bed. Right, I need to go make food now. Oh, that is so sweet. Really nice. Frey will have got one as well. Oh, good night, Haz. Sleep well. You're in such a good mood now. I am, yeah. You're gonna sleep well, Charlie. The man on the train pissed me off, and now I'm happy. Good. Right. Good night. Oh, I'm so happy now. Basically, what I was just saying is, there were a man on the train and he was talking to his girlfriend like actual shit. And I was sat there like, just pretend it's not happening, Byron. Because I'm not an angry person, but when I see someone, especially a man dominating a woman in like an aggressive way, in public especially, like around everyone, like, People, couples argue and people argue, but when you can see that the woman's so inferior to the man in this case, not that women are inferior to men at all, that's not what I'm saying, but when you can clearly see that the man knows that the woman feels inferior to him and he's still like blatantly arguing with her and like she's, the woman was not replying, she was just letting him slander her and slander her and slander her and basically publicly humiliate her because she were on the freaking tube. Men are assholes apparently, so women, if you're watching this, don't let a man make you feel inferior to him because he's probably a prick and you're probably not. And men out there, if you're watching, don't be an asshole just because you're a man. On that note, I'm gonna go into bed, put my new heater on, eat my Cheerios because I'm up early in the morning and it's literally, what time is it? Let me just tell you the exact time. It is literally 3.27 in the morning and we have only just got back from seeing Saffron and Anastasia. On that note, I'm gonna end this vlog here. I love you all lots and I will chat to you in the morning. I've actually got a pretty exciting day tomorrow. I'm not gonna tell you about it because I'm gonna end this vlog, but I've got an exciting day and then I'm working in the evening. So look forward to for tomorrow's vlog. I'll let you know how the heater goes, if it's like actually good or not. I love you all lots and I will chat to you in the morning. Good night.